Hey guys, Super Horror Bro Mike here, and in today's video, we are continuing our playthrough of Dead Space. This is part 5, of course, of the playthrough, and in the last video, we just boarded this ship. This was the rescue ship that came out to help us, that of course crashed after the escape pod was uh, docked with it, and one of the necromorphs got off and escaped into the ship. So guys, we are actually on board now as Isaac, we're going to continue our adventure. I'm actually going to try and finish up the game in today's video. So this is going to be a very long video, but hopefully you'll enjoy seeing me finally finish the game. So sit back, relax, grab a snack, grab a drink, and let's continue our playthrough of the Dead Space Remake. Okay, so first through this door it looks like. Oh, we've got a guy. What's... What is that? What the heck was that? That was fast. That was a fast enemy. We should heal up. Oh, we don't even have any healing stuff. We've got this guy, which has just been absolutely destroyed as the ship collided. Oh, health. Whoa, that, that's bright. He doesn't like that. <laughs> that's kind of cool how he reacts to fire. Isaac, we have a problem. The Valor's carrying a 12 megaton warhead. The crash hit the torpedo bay hard. I need you to handle that nuke right away before something sets it off. Handle 12 megatons? You know I'm not a nuclear engineer, right? I don't need you to be. Just stabilize the warhead and eject it away from the Ishimura. Christ, Hammond. No one trained you to carve up monsters with a plasma cutter either. You haven't let us down yet. So yeah, Hammond is on board with us, of course. And I don't know whether to trust Hammond or not, because he seems a bit sus, but... I honestly don't remember the story to Dead Space that well, so we maybe should trust Hammond. I, I honestly don't know right now. But I'm going to choose to trust him for now, guys. We're going to keep going. We need to stop this nuke, apparently, that's aboard the ship. So let's go and find it, disable it, and hopefully save the day. Look at this dude. Passed out unconscious there. Well, probably more than unconscious, right? Oh, God, that guy's completely dead. They've kind of got super suits on, haven't they? They've got, like, um, these kind of really cool-looking suits on. Which is pretty awesome. What is that? Oh god, is that one of them? It's like mutated. Um, okay. How do we stop him? Freeze him? Whoa, that doesn't even slow him down that much. Okay. Shoot the legs. Shoot the arms. They're very fast, those things. Is he even dead? I think so. Yeah, they're very fast. They're like, um, shapeshifters almost, aren't they? The soldiers must have had stasis units on their armor. When they were turned, those units merged right into their bodies. Oh, Chased the stasis. Them. They're fucking fast, Isaac. Stay sharp. Yeah, so the stasis units, the stasis suits is what causes them to, like, move like that. That's really cool. Okay, is that okay? We, uh, use the elevator? No? What the heck? <laughs> the battery just dejected and flew out. I guess we need a new battery. There's the Ishimura, the ship we were on. So this is Operation White Light. CEC vessel USG Ishimura is in breach of EarthGov system isolation order, believed to have recovered Marker 3A. So we've heard a lot about the Marker, obviously. Special Ops has confirmed the system, but are unable to provide the planet location. Special Ops advisory follows. Exercise extreme caution. If Marker 3A has been recovered on board, infection is credible threat. Well, we know it is because everyone's turned into necromorphs. Shock point to Argus system. Move to position out of local scope range and await signal from Mishimura to confirm location. So these were the objectives of these uh, like soldiers. They were to secure the marker and then if an infection is present, initiate sterilization protocol, which I guess is just wipe everything out. If the infection is not present, initiate containment protocol Apollo. All personnel, without exception, submit to full psychological examination during their debriefing. Because obviously the marker affects people's like minds and stuff. Oh. Oh, one of you guys. Okay. I'm going to use the blade on you. There we go. My favorite weapon, as you guys will know, is this blade. Followed up by this one. Right, he's down. Come on, then. Oh, my God. We've got one of these birds. Okay, shoot the birds. We've got to stop the birds from regenning them. No. Stop. Stop. Okay, he's down. Man, this is hard. What the heck? 
Oh, we blasted the stasis unit off his suit. So that's kind of cool. Die. Okay, he's down. Good. Is that everyone? I think so. Man, that was uh, that was a bit hectic. Let me just go through here as well and check if I've missed anything. This is Commander Cadigan to all hands. We have been boarded by hostile forces. Hostiles are aliens. Repeat, aliens and extremely dangerous. All personnel to arms. Fire at will. Yeah, we already knew that. We've encountered far too many of them ourselves. Alright, let's go and place this battery unit in the elevator now. And be on our way. Sweet. I need health. I'm running really low on ammo and really low on health. Mr. Clark? Hello? Who's this? I, I must speak with you. Who is this? Dr. Terrence Kine. The Ishimura's chief science officer. I studied the marker for the church. I'm done talking to unitologists. But, but, but the planet won't rest until the marker is returned. You, you can't leave. Watch me. Yeah, you just watch us leave, buddy. Oh, oh we got a save point. Okay, game is saved. We need to blast through this now. Oh, this is the nuke. Okay, we want to be very careful in here, guys, not to destabilize the place. Power acquired. Okay, let's... Should we shoot through these? Oh, my God. We do not want that to explode in here. Because uh, that would be very bad around the nuke, right? <laughs> let's just shoot this guy. There we go. Take him out. Stamp him. Okay, good. Now we need to shoot these. Disable the power and take the nuke offline. Okay, is that done? We need to put a battery in here as well. Oh yeah, there it is, look. Okay, grab that. Be very careful. Just gonna plug this in. Take the nuke offline. Done. Power is stored, okay. So now we go over here, and we activate. So we're just dropping it down there, are we? Awesome. Very careful now, very careful. I think we're all good, maybe. Warhead has been released. Warhead ejected. I think we've done it. Okay, the warhead's clear. Damn it, this doesn't add up. If the Valor was just on patrol, why bring a nuke? And if they had a target, what's out here except us? Yeah, I know. I'm downloading a munitions report right now. I'll clear your route to the engine room. Grab that singularity core and let's get out of here. Sweet, we did it. Okay, so we disposed of a warhead. Now where do we need to go? Through here. Salvage for singularity core. Okay, got it. Ooh, what is this? Shooting range. Activate. I'll activate it. Online. Caution. Live fire exercise. Ah, oh, nice. Look, we get the high score, guys. So you don't want to shoot the blue ones, I'm guessing, because they're like, you know, sieves. <laughs> this is kind of fun. Like a little mini game. I've got this one as well. Oh no! Oh no. Okay. That's gonna put an end to our fun. I'm gonna keep going, guys. We're getting the high score. Oh no! Okay. Maybe not. Maybe not a good time for the high score uh, burn. And just sword them up a little bit. There we go. That's a good combination, I think. Are they dead? I think they are. Wait, you, are you still alive? Oh my god, you can never tell in this game. You can just still be alive sometimes. Anyone else? You? You want some as well? Huh? Have some of that. Okay, I think we're good. I'm still good playing the shooting game, guys. I'm still playing the mini game. Ah! Get off me! Little freaks. 
Okay, is that it? Yeah, the lockdown's disengaged. Shooting range out of service. Please contact maintenance. So, did we get the high score? Score 600. I don't know what it wanted us to get. Oh, I think we got some stuff. This is, this is like our reward for playing the game, I think. Yeah, we got power nodes and everything. Sweet. That's kind of cool, then. It was kind of worth it. Right through here. Okay, just holding your leg there, eh? Break a leg, man. Um, I'm just gonna leave you there. I'm gonna keep going. You just rest up, man. Oh no, how are we gonna get past this, guys? Guys, we need, we need this. Ah! Oh, he ran through the lasers. I think he got destroyed by the lasers. <laughs> I was going to throw the stasis at him. Okay, cool. We don't want that to happen to us, though. So, uh... Let's have a look. How are we going to avoid this? Yeah, now we run past. I want to get off this ship immediately. I don't trust it. Isaac, you hearing this? It's Chen. There, on the ring link. Did I lock him in alive? Chen's dead. You know that. I know my own fucking corporal. Jen, come in. Oh no, Hammond's being influenced by the Marker 2 now, thinking that Chen guy is still alive, although we all know that he turned into a necromorph. Happened in like episode 2, I think. In fact, I think that's the, the doctor that turned into the necromorph that boarded the ship and killed all these guys. Wow, okay. That is a, uh, a messy sight right there. A lot of strawberry jam. <laughs> so these guys just got destroyed. That's the escape pod, isn't it? Yeah, that's what Cheng was in. And he got out of that and just, just killed all of these people. So where are we meant to be going? It says go this way to get to the Singularity Core. Wait, why has that happened? No, you little freak. Oh, it's one of these guys, the pregnant ones. No, get off. What are you doing? Oh, okay, what we need to do here is um, is run because I haven't actually got any ammo for that gun and I thought I did have. <laughs> I need to switch out my weapons, but I don't think I've got any others on me right now. Okay. Who do we have here? One of these little babies. No problem. Anyone else? Oh, yeah, there's someone over there. Oh, no, it's a shapeshifter. Oh, we hit his, uh, we hit his call, though. Nice. Let's blast him. Let's try and hit the singularity core in the middle of them, and it blasts them like that, and then you go in for the kill. It's really effective. Nice. Oh, I think he's still alive, so I'm going to backtrack a little bit. Oh my god, guys. It's one of these brutes. Let's stun him. Hopefully the electricity gets him again. We need to shoot the yellow stuff on his back, right? to take one of these guys down in previous episode. I think it was episode two. Oh my god. Run, 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 run. That's it. You get stuck in there, man. Okay. He is still coming for us. Boom. Get stuck in. Okay, that's not working. Let's just use a blade to carve him up. I think he's dead. He's down. Yeah, suck on that. Okay, we survived. Man, that was insane. Attacked by enemies from all different directions. <laughs> Including one of those big boss enemies. The Valor's reinition log. It wasn't just a nuke. They came loaded for war. Seek and destroy. This was no patrol. They knew about the Ishimura. Someone knew. Yeah, they were we coming were to dead. destroy it. From the and take we the marker. Arrived. We already read the note, man. Engine room through here. Warning room, uh, 
Warning, engine room access. Do not enter combustion chamber while the engine is in operation. I'm saving the game, guys, because I have a feeling that we're going to get toasted if we walk through there. Okay. We're going to make... Oh, that was close. See, this is what I mean. This is going to be very tricky to go through. One wrong movement and we get toasted. Come on. Come on, stop. Oh, I think we need to use the box on this one. Yeah, like that, and run. Okay. Ooh, I almost walked through that. I didn't realize the engine was going to blast like that. Okay, we need to get to the other side of this, I think. So maybe... Use the box like this. I think this is how we're going to have to do it. We're going to have to use the box, like, one at a time. This is actually really awkward to play, though. Look at that, though. Beautiful. we got skills here. Could be a firefighter. Gonna place one down here. Lovely. It's like Portal, isn't it, with a companion cube? Right, so now we'll turn off the fire. Turn on the elevators. A. Oh, no. Okay, you know what? I'm turning the fire back on, guys. And they're going to be blasted. Watch this. Now we just grab this. <laughs> he just gets blown away. Didn't go quite as smoothly as I'd hoped, turning the fire back on there, but you know. You get what the intention was, right? Okay, we should be able to get to the elevator now, I think. Yeah, look, we've powered it up. Hopefully we can meet up with Hammond and uh, get the heck off this place. I love the details in this game. Look at this, like the little animations and stuff. The lighting. So cool. Unknown biohazard detected. Lockdown initiated. Oh no! We need to get to that core. Another malfunction. There's Hammond. I, see some in the red. Someone get the door open. I feel like Hammond is a good guy, right? He's gonna probably die now. <laughs> Oh, it's Chen. Help me get him to the Kelly. Shoot. No, man. It's not Chen. Shoot him. What? No, why would he think that he could save him? He's sacrificing himself. Oh, okay. That's messy. We need to get this, guys. We need to finish the mission. Singularity Core, pick it up. Okay, we got it. We should probably go, right? Oh, okay, hey, yeah, let's run. Damn, it's God. Damn it, shit. Oh my God. Keep going. Fuck! The battery's gonna blow. Go! I'm trying, man. I'm trying to run. So Hammond sacrificed himself, but I think the marker was like influencing his mind. At least we know Hammond wasn't a bad guy now. He was actually like a good guy. I judged him prematurely there. Oh, because, you know, he was like looking for our files at the start of the game and stuff. And he seemed a bit sinister. But um, OK, we're going. Yeah, it shows that you shouldn't always uh, prejudge. You should always wait for all the information to present itself. Go, 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 go. Ah, blast it. Open, open, open. Oh, no, we got... Got. Wait, there's one trying to get off the ship there. Look at him. He's just running away. He's locked the door. Great. He's freaking locked the door. Where are we going then? Back? Yep. All right, we need to escape. The whole place is coming down around us. Grab that med pack and go. Go, go. Isaac, run. Okay, we need to wait. Bide our time and now run. We're getting off this ship before it blows. Oh, okay. Maybe the other way is better to go. Maybe not. I don't know. I'm just going to keep going, guys. Here's the exit. Here's the exit. Through here. Jump, Isaac. Oh, wow. Okay, maybe not. He just made a leap of faith there, didn't he? Into space. It's all he could do, but look at this. This is insane. We... We're going to get blasted into space at this rate. Oh, we actually made it. Nice. That was kind of sick. Man, that was cool. 
That was a cool moment. We're back in this room, the stupid puzzle room that I hated. Isaac, come in. I'm here. Fuck, that was close. Chen, Johnston, now Hammond, an Amtrak movement from the Valor. I think some of those mutated soldiers made it on board. What about the Valor's Singularity Corps? It's covered in blood, but I got it. God, I hope Hammond was right about that shuttle. He said it was on the crew deck, along with every unitologist on the ship and their marker. You need to... Wait, someone's opened the door near the bridge atrium? It'll get you to the crew deck, but who's left with that kind of clearance? Isaac, something's up, but we have to get that shuttle. For God's sake, be careful. We're all that's left. Okay. We've got to get that shuttle. Chapter 9 completed, guys. We've done one chapter already. Chapter 10, end of days. Ooh, is this the last chapter? Reach the executive shuttle. Okay, guys, I think we've reached where we need to get to, roughly. I'm kind of going to be cutting out a lot of the backtracking in this episode, just to keep the episode a bit shorter, as it's going to be a longer one. That's the way we go to the tram. Let me just check my map. I want to make sure we're not missing any of the uh, different rigs. Oh, there's one just over here, actually. Look at this. I don't really want to go down here, though, because it's very dark and I can hear something actually snarling. What the heck is that? Oh, man, it's one of these. Okay, let's use our line gun now, our line rack gun, which is a new weapon, guys, which I've actually just equipped because some of you were asking me to try some of the other weapons. So, wow, that works as well. I don't do that often enough either, guys. You grab... um. You grab bits of the bodies of the enemies and you can chuck them back at them to impale them, which is pretty cool. Hey, look, there's, that was where it was. I just picked it up from my arm. So we've got Benson's rig now, so that's another rig done. Now we'll head over to the story objective, which was over here. Isaac, I'm losing you. Something on the crew deck must be interfering with the signal. I can guess what that something is. If the marker's active, shit. The crew deck is locked down, but the deck supervisor might have an override key. The last location I have for her is the gym. How long will it take to install the Singularity Core on that shuttle? Not long, if no one tries to stop me. Hurry! We can't leave the marker in their hands. Yes, yeah, so we're trying to install the Singularity Core on the shuttle. That's our objective. Man, I don't like the candles. This looks sinister. Like cultist. Okay. And it is. Wow. Look at all the markings on the ground. Holy crap. What went down here, man? This is nuts. All right. Well, we're just going to ignore that and move past it. Can we go through here? We need a key card. What is this? Is that meant to be the unitology symbol for the church? Because of course these are all like religious fanatics. Like part of the unitology, which is the religion in this game. Alright, I guess to uh, the gym. That's where we're meant to be headed, right? I don't think I'd want to attend this gym, that's for sure. I can hear someone singing Twinkle Twinkle Little Star as well, which is very creepy. Man, everybody in here is just dead. Just completely KO'd. And the shower jump scare again. How many times is that now, guys? Like four shower jump scares in this game? Let's just get out of here. Oh, that one died in the toilet. It obviously had a heavy night out. Schematics. Ooh, advanced engineer rig schematics. That'll be good. Text log. Z ball rules. This must be their like space sport. So you can read that if you want, guys. It's about how to play Z ball, which is an anti gravity ball. And look, it looks like we've got um, we can win prizes on this. <gasps> I have to take part in this game of Z ball. Let's go. Entering zero gravity. Oh, look at this. This is cool. Can we play Z-Ball? Is that something we can do in this game? Oh yeah, I think we can. I think we can. Let's take the battery in first. Zero 
We'll go and power up the elevator. And now... We'll go and play some Z-Ball, guys. Hopefully. Look at this. Hey! This is cool. Go! <laughs> okay. So what do we do? Fire it in the holes? Yeah! Look at this! Let's see how good we are at Z-Ball. Go! This is fun. Not very hard, though. Does it matter what color we go for? Doesn't look like it. Score 35 of 40. We've almost done it already. Oh, it goes up. It goes up, though. Oh, and it gets harder because, look, they've covered a hole now. So now we've got to be a bit more selective. Oh, no. Okay, we've got to be a bit quicker than this, I reckon. No, what the heck am I doing? Mike, what are you doing? you got to aim for the middle of the hole there. I mean, way too slow. Pro play this is, guys. We're almost at 160. I think there was like six prizes, right? So maybe there are six levels. Gotta be a bit faster here. We're running out of time. No. Quick. We get three more balls in before the time limit expires. Did I just hear someone say here, Isaac? That's kind of creepy. Oh, we just made it. Level six, this is the last one, guys. But it's getting really hard now. We can do it, we can do it, we can do it, we can do it. Come on, faster. Give me another ball. We've got to get another four balls in. I don't think we're going to do this, guys. I don't think it's possible. No, I think we needed to be fast for this. We're almost there. No, we missed it by five points. By one ball. I'm not doing it again. We're going to have to have second place, guys. I missed it by one ball, though. That is annoying. Look at this. The only one that we're denied. Never mind. You know what? I'll just, uh, I'll be happy with second place. Second place is nothing to sniff at. We partook in some sports. That was kind of fun. Yeah, look, this is where they watched from. They would watch from up here, but they're not watching anymore. What is this? Oh, this is a key card we needed. Okay, now we can head back down. I can't believe we didn't get attacked then. I assumed we would uh, just be like swarmed by enemies when we picked that up. Right, I'm going to go this way now. Okay, back in this creek. Oh! And now we've got enemies. Wait, can I shoot you? Oh no, we've got one of these freaking... We've got one of these. Not anymore, we don't. Oh no, we've got another! Are you kidding me? There's two? They're trying to resurrect them. They're trying to resurrect all the dead people. I hope I killed that third thing. I don't know if I did, guys, but... Shoot the arm off. I'm going to try and do something here, guys. Shoot the arm off, then pick it up, and then fire it at this one. There you go. Let's do it again. That is satisfying. Using their own arms against them. All right, I think we've killed them all. That should be everyone, I think. Yes? Good. Okay, let's go. Use the key card. Security card. We're getting out of this room. I don't want to spend a single second longer than I have to in this room. This episode has been uh, a little bit dark. I'll say that much. A little bit sinister. But at least we got to play some like V-ball or whatever it's called. Or Z-ball. That was kind of fun. I built your shit. It didn't work. You're not going to hurt anyone else. Still alive, Mr. Clock. I'm still denied convergence. Thanks. That would be so terrifying. Mercer, wait. It's being frozen like that with a guy pointing a gun at you. I want to understand. What is convergence? 
but you already know. Dead or living, we all feel the markers to purpose. Don't you want to be reunited with the people you lost? Hi. Yes. Then why not with me? Mr. Temple has refused. But we are so close. Everything that is That guy is absolutely rest. terrified right now. Look at his eyes. When you put it that way, you and your marker can go to hell. Oh man, that is harsh. Yeah, you'd feel the pain for longer, wouldn't you, in stasis? I think your death will come first. That doctor's truly twisted, I think. I'm gonna take him out. I'm gonna look forward to it. Whoa! Oh no, it's for Regener! The guy that regenerates. I don't even know if this is the right gun for him. Okay, we yeah, we, we need to saw him up and then we can escape. I'm guessing the idea is that we need to get out of here. Where are we going? Through there? The door's blocked. Oh, guys. This. Is that going to clear it up? Yeah, that's clearing the door up, I think. Look. Okay, good. We just need to take him down again so we can run away. Okay, give me some power. I'm going to freeze you. I'm going to saw you up. This guy, you can't kill him. He just regenerates. Hopefully at some point we'll get to kill him. But for now, we're just going to have to uh, run. I'm going to just break this throw. <laughs> I always want to get the merch, you know. <laughs> get the merch and then run. All right, we're getting out of here. Oh, I want that as well. Nice. All right, let's go now. There's something over there, though. I want everything. <laughs> I want everything before I leave. Okay, can we go? Is he coming for us? I think we're good. Run, run, run. Oh, no. Sticky, slow-moving floor. I have a worst possible time. I think we've escaped him for now. Yeah, we're good. Man, Chen's talking to us now. We know not to trust that because he's turned into a necromorph. But this place, look. All drunk at the bar. Um, I forgive you. Just leave me alone. Alright, guys, we're going over here. We're going to pick up this. We're going to keep moving forward. Objective complete. I can't even see what the objective is. Clear a way to the shuttle. That's our new objective. I think I'm going to switch out the line rack gun. I have used it a little bit to show you guys what it was like, but I honestly don't like it that much. That's kind of why I was using the weapons I was. So I'm actually going to switch that and put it back in our inventory as well. We've also got, look at this guys, the major like advanced suit. It's like the last suit that we can get. So I don't know if maybe we should unlock that. See if we've got enough to get the final suit because that'd be pretty sweet. I think we might just have enough for it. Yeah, we've got 60k. We can buy it. Should we do it? For the lols, here we go. Unique suits. This is going to allow us to upgrade to maximum capacity. But also, it's very costly. It'll also make him look like a badass. Which I'm all in favour for. Hey, look at that. We've reached maximum level now. As you can see, he's bulky. It's looking good. Sweet. Can't afford anything else, of course, now. Let's move forward. Where are we headed? This way? Looks like it. 
I can hear Dr. Mercer. Oh, he's here. He's on a projector. A hologram. Patient? Isaac. Symptoms? Mania? He's talking to us directly. <laughs> right, I don't know what we're meant to be doing. I think we're meant to be taking out these tentacles, maybe, so we can get through. Destroy the tendril in standard quarters. Yeah, we have to destroy the tendril. Okay. So, how do we do that? Do we have to get through this door? It's very blocked. <laughs> Somebody didn't want us getting in here, so it kind of makes me question what's on the other side. There's only one way to find out. That's to press forward. Oh, okay. It's uh, a bit smoggy in here. We need to find the source of that toxic hazard. Oh man, I can hear him actually. Oh no, it's one of these things. Alright, let's toast them. There we go. I used the alternate fire that time to destroy them. You can use alternate fire on each weapon, so I did that with the... Uh, Flamethrower there, guys. It's pretty sick. We need to find the source of all this smog, though. Oh, here. Nice. That'll clear up the air. Or at least it hopefully will. Yes. Oh, no. Wait, is this for... This is a regening guy again, isn't it? Yep. I've got something for you, buddy. It's called... A saw blade. You know what? Screw this. I'm running. I don't have time for you. Where are we headed? Oh, we need to destroy the tendril in the deluxe quarters next, it says. Which is through here. I'm just running. I'm not even paying attention to any of these guys. Screw that. Are we safe? I think we're going to have to backtrack to get a battery for this place, unfortunately. Not that I want to. Oh, great. Yep, yeah, come then. Boom. Look, we're going to take the arm, grab it in midair, and fire it into this guy. How cool is that? We're going to do it again. I think we grabbed the blunt side of the arm that time. We'll try it again, though. No! There's bloody blasting us with stuff. Oh, we pinned him that time. Let's try it with this rod. Nice. I like this game. <laughs> I like the crazy stuff you can pull off, like pinning him with this rod. Okay, now we've taken care of those guys. We need to find a battery. Where would one be? Oh, here we go, guys. We found a battery in the storeroom just outside the room we were just in and that's very glitchy <laughs> so we'll uh, backtrack with that in a second once we've stocked up okay one battery acquired in the slot it goes progress has been made so now we can go upstairs to the second level I think we're heading back to the main room now we've blown up the tendril but I don't know if we like need to do more or if that's it now oh what's that oh just a fan blade okay no worries I can deal with that yeah we're back in this room now okay so oh yeah look we destroyed one of the arms of this like massive goop because we're trying to get to a marker. That's the objective, isn't it? This is the marker here, and we need to get to that. So, yeah, we're trying to basically destroy all this, like, crap that's all over it. So I guess now we head upstairs using the elevator. All right, nice. What's the objective now? We need to go this way. Okay. Okay. We get it, we get it, we get it. We're on the job. 
every time we go into a new room, it's just even more haunting than the last. And we've got a lockdown situation. What, is that us? <laughs> no, it's, the, it's these guys. Never mind. You know what? I got an idea. Oh, come on, man. You spoiled my fun. Let me do it. Let me do it. Okay, they're, they're ruining this for me. I just wanted to grab the fan blade. I'm just going to have to go with the old boring saw again. Well, maybe I can just... Oh, God. Okay. Did not expect that. Touche. Nice. Use the old arm against him again. There we go. Just slapped into the ground. Could be playing better in this video. I'll be honest. Quarantine lifted. I keep trying to do cool stuff and it backfires. I should just shoot them. I'm trying to conserve a little bit of ammo here. It's telling us to go this way. This place. I don't know, guys. I don't know about it. Use his little arm against him. Hit him like that. Nice. Sometimes it works, and other times it kind of backfires on me. Crew member laughing. Who's that? Are you alright? You kind of look like you need a helping hand here. Um... Oh god, okay. I'm just gonna move past that. Okay, so here's the battery, so we take that. And we need to find out where it goes. Oh, over here, look at that. You can see, there's a place for the battery. I knew that was gonna happen, that's why I put it down. Nicely done. If I may say so myself. Okay, now before we do anything else, let's see if there's anything else we can uh, explore here. Ooh. What the heck's going on? What the heck? This has got to be a vision, right? Like a, uh, a marker vision. Isaac. Sorry, late shift. How are you? I, um... My mother, she's, um... Octavia? How's she doing? How's she doing? Looks like a flashback. She's dead, Nicole. Dead, Nicole. They both are. She killed my dad, then herself. Oh. Yeah. The church... They, uh, took the bodies before I could, uh... Oh, Isaac, I'm so sorry. Walking in and told you stop, brainwashing. Stop it. Just stop talking. You said she was herself again. You said she would be better at home. I trusted you. You might as well have killed him yourself. She was better. You told me to leave for the Ishimura. You, you pushed me to... You know what? Go to hell, Isaac. Nicole. Nicole. Isaac kind of acted like a douchebag there. I did. Blaming her. Oh, God. Blaming no. his girlfriends for uh, his mother's oh, death. You. What are you doing, Isaac? Past Isaac. What an idiot. Isaac. It's me. I should have talked to you. She wanted to talk. I didn't lose her. Sorry. I can make it right. I'm sorry. I can save us both. About everything. That's kind of cool. I don't think that was in the original. I'm pretty sure. Unless I'm just completely misremembering. It seems like Isaac has some regrets in his relationship, you know? 
lost his mother and then he kind of blames Nicole. And his mother was part of the unitology, you know, the religion of unitology. And it seems like Isaac comes from a religious family as well. Anyway, we've got a weapon upgrade here, force gun upgrade, and something to play here. Log retrieved. Oh, it's a Nicole it log. Recording? Can't miss anything. Oh no, it's Mercer. He was deciphering how the creepy doctor signal affects the brain and how... Oh my god. Ah, Dr. Brennan. Let me guess. Terence Kine let you in. Shame he's not here. He didn't understand how this tragedy represents a chance. To cure death. Go on. These creatures. Reanimated tissue, cellular immortality. I, I know we've never seen eye to eye, but I understand now. There's so many I should have saved. So you came to me? Because. You've learned how to communicate with the Marker. I'm so close. I, I thought it must have the secrets that I need. You are a woman of science. Not faith. Leave the Marker to me. These are your autopsy notes. Very thorough. You'll need them peer-reviewed, of course. And poor Terence isn't here to help you. Yes. There's only one man I trust now. Is that Isaac? That's why she calls for him, right? And he comes, but he, f he gets here too late. Very thorough indeed. When all hell's broken loose. Dr. Mercer's the cause of it, well, partially the cause of it. Useful. For Mr. Harris's next surgery. He's been working on research for the marker, of course. No That's cool, though. Logged. We find out some lore, finally. Scientific methods complete as a side mission. Ah, oh, cool. Okay. Right, guys, let's get back on track, then. So the next thing we need to do, I think, is plug this in here. Like that. Nice. Turn on the doors, turn on the lights. Oh, maybe just turn on the doors then. Oh no! Alright, alright. I should have known. You dead? I think so. So where do we go? Oh, maybe it's just shooting this. Hey, that's all it was. Okay, we did it. Um, and everybody has woken up, so we're going to get out of here. Go. Run. Leave. 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 Are we safe? Yeah, we, go we can go back. I'm not investigating that place any more than I have to. Screw that. So... We've destroyed that now. Every time we, like, destroy one of these tendrils, the hunter shows up. You know, the enemy that can regenerate? It's, like, really creepy. We can now go down here. So this is where the executives lived. I guess, like, the high-level people running the ship. Yeah, look at this. These were all, like, the prominent people that ran the ship. Got this guy. Oh, he's holding a gold semiconductor. Thank you for that. This old dude. That guy just looking out at the uh, at the air pensively. Oh man, this is kind of cool. Look, they've got parts of a marker like in these tubes. Man, everybody's just died here as well. They just didn't want to be around these uh, monsters. I guess they didn't want to turn into necromorphs, probably. That's probably what it was. They saw everything was going south. Let's check this room. 
Oh, wow. There's a marker with all the candles. And I'm celebrating it. What the heck? You can make us whole again? I don't know about that. I keep hearing that expression. And I don't like the sound of it. A text log. Eternal rest. Join us in paradise to Captain Mephias. It's from an unidentified sender. Referencing our pre-departure discussion, I am blessed to report that the Vested have authorised a premium stasis capsule for you aboard the Church's Holy Fleet. Congratulations. I must reiterate that this berth is conditional upon the successful completion of your pilgrimage. Once the marker is safely delivered to the Church hands and all electronic records have been appropriately amended, which basically means deleted, I think, I will be pleased to finalise your resting place amongst the church's most blessed, including Altman himself. And that's sent from Phoebe Tremaine, the sanctified messenger. She's part of the Church of Unitology. So it seems like the people running this ship were on like a holy mission to get the marker to the church. And we need to stop it because we can see, you know, what it's doing to everything that it's touching. Spreading this kind of virus. Alright, anyway, let's go and blast the stuff over here now. We'll blast this and we'll get out. Done. Right, I'm running because we all know what's going to happen now, right? I can already hear it all booting up. Go, go. Oh, no. It's a lockdown. It's a lockdown, guys. I've got a text log here as well. I haven't got time to read that, though. All right, we're just going to cut you down to size a little bit. Now we can grab your arm. Oh no, we've got the birds! We've got the birds! Destroy it! Destroy it! Destroy it! Destroy it! Destroy it! Screw you. Man, this is not going the way I'd hoped for it to go. I need to blast off his arm so I can grab it and fire it back at him. There we go. That worked. No. Give me that arm. Wait, is it? Oh, there's this one here. Okay. No, I don't want that. I want the arm. I want the arm. I want the arm. Oh my god, it's not working. Why? I'm just going to carve him up. Screw it. Okay, lockdown lifted. We made it. Somehow. It wasn't pretty. But we got there in the end. I'm going to get out of here now, guys. I don't want to be in that place. I know it's the executive lounge. But uh, I'd rather be in the commoner's lounge, I think. <laughs> Because that place is uh, freaky. Oh, is that the final one? Yeah, look at that. We should be uh, able to clearly get to the marker now. So we need to go around here now because the tentacles have been cleared. I just need more health. You know, that's all I care about right now. Oh, no. This place looks bad. Oh, it's there, though. Sweet. Hi, I'm, I'm Dr. Terrence Pine. Sure. Remember, we spoke on the ballot. If you're real, let me in. I need to destroy that cluster behind you. Not yet. Not, if, escape on that shuttle, and you'll kill us all. When they took the marker from Aegis 7, it woke the being in the core of the planet. <laughs> What the heck is that? <laughs> Got a giant thing. The hell is that? That's what I just said, Isaac. Mercer calls it the hive mind. Nexus organs which controls these necromorphs telepathically. If we leave while the hive mind is active, well, you saw the battle. If even a single necromorph escapes, humanity is finished. 
the marker. Amelia, she knew. She told me it would return the beast to its slumber. Okay. So if we return the marker to Aegis 7, it'll stop the outbreak? Exactly. But we need the shuttle to return it to the planet. You have a singularity core. And I can let you do So what do you say? If it'll end this for good, deal. Excellent. I, I, I could distract Mercer, but not for long. And get the marker to the shuttle bay quickly. Okay. Thank you, Mr. Clark. So we need to get the marker to the shuttle bay. We're going to help out this doctor for now. Cool. Is he going to let us in? Or is he just walking off? He's just leaving. Okay, great. Thanks, man. Oh, has he let us in now? Okay, he didn't want to be in the same room with us. We've got too much blood on us. So I guess we shoot this. Let's get the last one out of the way. There we go. Mission complete. Tentacle destroyed. Now we need to get the marker to the shuttle, which is what we've been asked to do. So I think it's probably time to return to this main chamber. Because, of course, this is going to get destroyed now. Ugh, we just stood underneath it. Of course we did, as it explodes. And as you can see... The marker is now completely clear to move through those doors. So, let's head downstairs. And let's get this ball rolling. Oh, no. Oh, man. Alright, I'm just going to have to kill these guys first, I think. That was a nice quick kill. Okay, I'm going to use this to kill that one. Beautiful. Cleave this guy up a little bit. So far, so good. Boom. Wow. You still alive? I can never tell if these guys are dead or not, man. They... I think there's someone behind me, by the way. run. <laughs> I had to blow him up so I could just escape then. We've got some... It's weird they glow red when they're next to the marker. It's very strange. Is that it? Have we done it? I think so. It actually went okay. It's a bit frenetic, but it's fine. Ah, okay guys, we've uh, we've got a mission to do, so let's start this rolling. We need to move this to the shuttle, it says. There's the marker going. And down it goes. Reach the executive shuttle. Ah, you have it. Now install the singularity core on the shuttle. I'll come help you load the marker. Damn, Mercer's close, hurry! All right, all right, I'm trying, I'm trying. So, the marker's over here. What is the objective here? What's it asking us to do? Oh, sitting in the ship. Reach the executive shuttle, we've reached it, nice. Singularity core replaced. Test fire shuttle engines to complete hardware installation. Okay. Install the singularity core. Where do we do that? In here? Yeah, we have to install the singularity core in here. There we go. Engine firing. Nice. Wait, what's that sound? Oh my god. What the hell? Oh no, it's that regening guy again. Wait a second. Guys, wait, wait, wait. Can we blast him with the engine? That's what I'm wondering. Can we blast him with the engine? Because if we can... If we can, guys, this is going to be very good for us. I'm going to saw his legs off. Okay, I'm going to run now, guys. I'm going to try and blast him with the engine in here. Let's see if this works. Ah, stop biting me! Freak! Blast him! 
We got it! Look, it worked! Nice! Finally! That guy is out of our hair forever. Because he can't regen from that. I just uh, kind of went wild there, guys. I didn't care that the enemies were attacking me. I was like, I'm getting this done. And there we go. We have finished him off. I haven't got a lot of health left, but you know what? Who cares? We just killed that brute. Okay. Well, um, I wasn't expecting that to happen. <laughs> Mercer, I hope you die so badly right now. I hate you. I hope he comes to a sticky end so badly. Yes! <laughs> you you get nothing, man. You get last prize. He's got crushed. Oh no, we're in a sticky situation here, though. I'm kind of sick of this thing pulling us around. I thought we took care of it for good in an earlier episode. Okay, um, whoa. Okay, stop following me, man. Let me shoot you. Okay, this is not going well for me. Shoot it, shoot it, shoot it. Quit. Okay, that was close. We were almost in its lair then. Pulled into its little hole. Do you read me? Mr. Clark! Mr. Clark, come I in! I read you, man, Fuck I read you. Ship. You're alive. Altman be. Fuck Altman, too. Kendra? Yeah. But every oh. alert on the Ishimura is screaming. Critical damage to internal systems. The marker just ripped right through the ship. Something pulled it down to the cargo bay. Kind. Pilot the shuttle to the hangar. I'm going after the marker. Of course. Amelia, quickly. Wait, Dr. Kine. That guy's lost it. He killed the captain. We can't trust him near the marker. He says returning it to the planet is the only way to end this. We've got to try. I'm heading to cargo. You paint Nicole's rig and tell her where to go. Leave it to me. Thanks. When I get the marker, we're all getting out of here. Okay, so we're going to all kind of squad up to try and get off this place. And that's the end of the chapter. There we go. Chapter 10 complete. Chapter 11. I don't remember this uh, game's ending, by the way, guys, so I honestly don't know how much longer we've got, but I imagine we're near the end now, because we're kind of sort of teaming up with the Doctor and trying to get off the ship with the marker, aren't we? So, you know, try and return the marker to the planet. So let's keep going. Oh, he's contacted us, guys, on the way back. Mr. Clark, we're approaching the hangar bay. We'll meet you there with the marker. Okay, sounds good. Yes, Amelia Sue. We'll send the hive mind back. He's talking the to the ghost of Amelia, man. He's gone crazy. So glad you gave that guy our only escape shuttle. Yeah, I was kind of thinking that. Shit, Isaac. Those things you've killed, the biomass is pulled down in the cargo bay. It's recombined itself into. Well, it's something huge, and the marker's embedded right in the middle. How the hell do we do this? I've got the Ishimura's cargo cranes. They can move half of the mining gear. No problem. If whatever's down there wants to wrestle for the marker, I'm in. Override the safeties, and yes, it might work. But hurry. We're losing critical systems fast. Okay, I wanted to, to let you guys listen to that so I didn't start attacking the enemy till after the cutscene ended. There we go. We've almost reached, I think, where we need to go uh, to get the tram. I think it's this way, right? Yeah, we need to get on the tram to head back now. Making some good progress, guys. As I said, we are going to finish the game in this video. I wanted to get it done because it hasn't been a super popular series, but I know there are some people that are really enjoying watching this, so I thought, let's finish it. Don't want to disappoint you. Oh, man. What the heck? All right, we're going this way. We're ignoring that, and we're running straight to the cargo bay. Hightail it this way. Emergency. Deck evacuation protocols are in effect. Hey, here we go, guys. We've reached the cargo bay. Wow. Look at that. 
We've got to go down there and move that marker for all this craziness. No. Oh, man. It's pulsing in here. Okay, down we go then, I suppose, into the depths of hell. Got to clear ourselves a path by the look of it. We've got one of these tentacles. Oh no, it's one of these guys. Okay, um, how do we do this? There we go. Just burn him. Just take out the little tentacle. You dead? You are now. Oh no, and we've got one of these guys. Just always explode them. If there's other enemies around with those enemies, I use the uh, little explosive thing against like crowd control. But if it's just for one, just blow it up. That's what I say. Looks like we've got to destroy all these tentacles now. There we go. One, two, three. Is that everything? We're obviously trying to clear a way for the marker, right? That's the objective. Yeah, engage the cargo crane. So where's that? This place looks really cool, though. The environments in this game are wild. Oh, there's the marker down there as well. I can see it now. Okay, so we need to engage that crane. First, I'm going to do a quick sweep of the room, guys. Um, just to see if I can find, <laughs> you know, anything useful, like that power node we just picked up. We're engaging the crane, picking up the marker. Oh, great. If it's going to be delayed, that basically means we're going to get swarmed by enemies in the meantime. Oh, no, it can't pick it up. The crane's not strong enough to pick up the marker. Oh, hello. It's too busy figuring out the crane puzzle to worry about this guy. Oh, no. It's okay, guys. It's okay. I was trying to pick up that thing. There. Thank you. Now I'm going to take your arm, grab it, skew you with it. And the other one too. That's it. Give me that arm. Boom. That was very close. Man. My shot is all over the place. Grab it. Okay. I'm back into the corner here. I don't know what's stopping me from going back. I think it was the wall. Loading shipment 782. Beginning retrieval. Look, when we get close to the marker, everything distorts. Oh, we've got an enemy. Boom. Nice. Let me do that again, please. Boom. I'm going to have to blow this one up, I think. There we go. Oh, no. This one's spawning little babies instead of those little weird mutants that you just... Ooh, hey. What is that? Just a tentacle? Can I destroy that? I think we can. We can shoot them. Wow, and they can really attack us as well. Man, everything is just destroying me right now. I need to destroy these tentacles, I think. Um, oh, you're back. Can I destroy these things? Yeah, we can. We can, we can actually blast them apart. We've just got to be careful we don't get too close to them. Let's sever it. Is Are you going to show back up? Yep. I'm going to burn it. Burn it. There we go. Okay, we severed it, guys. That's two down. I think we need some um, ammo, like stats. We need to lift this up, apparently. And then the marker can move past. Nice. So basically, we're trying to make a safe route for the marker to travel across this room. Like, that seems to be the uh, puzzle. Is it being blocked again? Oh, man, another one of these guys. Die. I think there's someone behind us as well. Okay. I'm going to knock you down. I'm going to knock you down, buddy. Sorry about that. Uh, reload. Oh, no. Explosive guy. Actually, explosive guy came in handy there. <laughs> cleared the way for us. Um, Alright, have some of this. Wow, okay. 
He has defense on. He can't shoot for his armor. I'm gonna run. I'm getting out of here, guys. Oh my god, there's two! Alright, we're gonna cut them down to size with a blade. My old friend for blade. It's been too long since we used this guy. Come on, saw the arms, saw the arms. Not the stomach for this one or I'll explode. Okay, good, good, good. Nicely done. And this is tricky. So we need to move the second access bridge around there. So we're going to want to go this side again. And there we go. Through the marker goes. Is that it? Have we done it now? That was a lot of fighting right there. I'm very low on ammo. Don't know what we've even got anymore. A bit of flame for our fuel. We got the spinny saw blades. I'm reading a cargo transfer. Oh, to the it's going up. Bay. Look. The marker. Good work, Mr. Clark. On our way. Kine, your flight path goes by airlock 19. I can get there from the computer core. A pickup. Yes, we'll be there. Can you make it to the airlock alone? No movement on the cameras. I I'm just gonna run for it. Wish me luck. Okay. We've transferred the marker to the loading bay. Our new objective is to meet Kine at the hangar bay. The hangar bay is where we started the game off, where we docked or kind of crash landed at the start of the game. So what I'm going to do, guys, is head back there and I'll probably cut to when we get there because, honestly, I'm not going to show you all this backtracking I keep having to do. But that was an epic fight down here for sure. Is there something behind here? Got a dead guy. What about in here? Peng. Oh. Emergency. <laughs> we just picked up a trophy called Peng. Alright, cool. We got a little statue. I wonder if we can sell that in the shop or something, maybe. Alright, guys, I'm going to go to the store, see if we can sell that statue we just picked up, that Peng statue. Field approaching maximum Let's have a look. Capacity. Now we can sell all the semiconductors as well. Yeah, that'll be good. We can buy some more ammo by selling all this stuff. So it is worth it. Wow, actually, I've just noticed as well, guys, look, the Peng statue is worth $30,000. An oddly intriguing artifact from the past. Sell at the store for credits. I'll do that. So we've got now... How much? 72,000? It's pretty good. I think I'm actually going to take out the contact beam, because I actually like that gun and I haven't used it too much yet. So we're going to start using that more going forward, especially towards the end of the game. Right, that's going to set us up nicely. Let's go. Pocket? Pocket's my brother. On the monitor, he's right by the airlock. Don't let this She's place seen get things. You. Kendra? The mark is getting brother, to Kendra now. I... He's not there. I can make it if I run. Everybody's getting messed with by the marker. Okay, so which way do we want to go? This way? Yeah, around here. Oh yeah, this is the start of the game, isn't it? This room was at the start of the game. Wait, who is that? This is where we were attacked at the beginning. We're, he we're hearing Hammond as well, which is kind of worrying. Alright, let's freeze this guy. Got to blow up his stasis in the middle of his suit. There we go. Nice. Now shoot the arms. Grab one of those. <laughs> and pin him. Nicely done. If I may say so myself, guys. Anyone else want a piece? Oh, you do, huh? I'm going to get the spam blade. Let's take you down nice and easy. Yeah, Hammond's talking to us. This is really weird. The marker must be messing with Isaac as well, right? No! I hate those things that fire, fire at us. We need to hit the um, stasis unit on this guy. There we go. That's what I wanted to do. Now I can take him down nice and slowly.
We're in a butcher's shop right now, guys. Getting some fine cutlets of meat. I don't think you'd want to eat it, though. We all good? I think we might have survived, right? Yes, we have survived. Cool. I'm going to save the game. Quarantine lifted. Mr. Clark, your colleague's safely on board. My name is Kendra Daniels. Stand by, Isaac. He's bringing the shuttle in now. Oh, that's cool. Look at that. He's flying in. We're getting off this place, guys. This is the end. At least I hope it is. Isaac, we can't run the automated loading controls. Must be the damage to the ship. We're losing time. The hive mind is down there. Kind, relax. I'll turn off the gravity in the hangar, then I can load the marker by hand. All right. No, don't worry, Amelia. They understand. He's still talking Jesus. to his dead wife or whoever she was. So weird. Okay, let's go. We've got to get the marker loaded by hand manually. Because the track's broken, I think. Was the general gist of what they were just talking about. So turn up the gravity. Zero gravity. Launch. Here we are. Where is the marker? That's what we need to know. Oh, here it is. Special delivery just for us. Just what I wanted, a demonic marker. It looks like it's online now. So we can unload it. There we are. Just step out of the way. Don't want to get squished. Um, so we've got to load this by hand, apparently. How are we going to do that? Looks like we need to power this thing up. There's a battery over here. We'll take that. There we are. Oh no, we've awoken these things. Come on then, little baby. That's one down. Two down. Kinda hurt myself a little bit there, but never mind. So we need to turn on cargo rail tracks, there we go. And now we can go up and operate the machinery. Let's have a look, what do we wanna do first? Market is down here. Oh, we set it going on the track. I get it. So now we need to align the track with that so that it keeps going. Got one of these guys, though. Best way to kill these guys, a bit of fire and then a machine gun. They go down so fast because you soften the meat up, guys. It's like slow cooking, you know? It's like when you slow cook lamb or something. I can hear more enemies. Oh, great. Yeah, there we go. Okay, come on. You're down. Now we want to turn this, I think. Oh, God. All right, that went fine. I keep firing the ammo away, and I don't know where it goes. I keep, like, smacking it away. Okay, now can we turn this and send it to the ship? I think we've done it. I think that's puzzle solved. Okay, we've got two of these guys. Now I've got one. Now we've got none. Okay, so the marker's over there, guys. We just need to restore the gravity, load it onto the ship, and we can get the heck off this rock. Get back to Earth, safe and sound. So, restore gravity. There we go. Zero gravity. They can take that up there. It's on board. Come, quickly. Go open the hatch for him. Cool. So, where do we go? This way? Let's backtrack away. Come, I guess. Ah, oh, I'm ready to get off this spaceship, man. I'm ready. Nicole, is she here? Oh, wait, what? Kain just got shot. Is that Kendra that did that? Oh, man. Okay, are we going to get crushed? Wow, that's a bit close. Look, we didn't get a suntan off those engines. 
I can't believe she betrayed us. I trusted her. Sorry, Isaac. I couldn't trust him with the marker. Kendra, what are you doing? What my department sent me here to do. Even if the Valor couldn't help me out like I wanted. Department? Who are you? I work for EarthGov, cleaning up a very, very old mess. She works for the enemies. I told you and Hammond that Aegis 7 was off limits. The planet was one big government experiment. The marker, this divine artifact, it was built by human hands. That's impossible. It's an alien world. The miners dug up the fucking thing. After it was planted here a few hundred years ago. Even kind didn't pick up on that. They found the first marker in some crater on Earth. That one. That was real. Alien. Enough to inspire unitology. Our people studied it and reverse engineered this red marker. So you built this one. But they needed somewhere to test it. Aegis 7. You've seen the result. The stuff of nightmares. I thought the old reports were just hysteria. Until I saw what I saw. They sealed off the whole system, buried the records nice and clean. Until CEC got greedy. Those idiots tore each of seven apart and woke up with the old research team left behind. So EarthGov sends you to sweep it all under the rug. Damn it, we have to return the marker. If anyone else stumbles across each of seven... It was disappeared once. We can do it again. I've seen how the marker fucks with your head. It must be contained. So she's trying to contain it. Does she think she's doing like the right thing then? For what it's worth. We made a great team. You'll find another way off the Ishimura. I mean, you're one hell of an engineer. Your experiment's gonna kill us all! Yeah, I feel like if she takes that back to Earth, Guff, we're all screwed. Um, so we gotta stop Daniels now. I can't believe she betrayed us. Like, honestly. It was all for nothing. I thought she was on our side. I don't even remember that happening in the original game. But it has been like 12 years since I've played Dead Space or something crazy. <laughs> Isaac, come in, it's Nicole. Where are you? In the flight control room. Please, you have to come up here now. There's still a way out for us, but we don't have much time. Meet Nicole in the flight control. Okay, so she's here for us. We've got to team up with Nicole. Hopefully get off this rock together. Destroy the marker. Get Daniels back somehow, I guess. Like, she's just escaped with the marker. That is not good news. Flight control, this is where we want to be. Hopefully Nicole's waiting for Emergency. us here. All personnel proceed you can see the mark on my screens. Ugh, I don't even want to know what that is. Let's just get out of here. Oh, here she is. Here's Nicole. There you are. Thank God you're here. The ship's coming apart. I saw what you've been through. Your investigation, Mercer, what happened with us? We don't have to talk about it. I need you to know I'm sorry about everything. It's okay, Isaac. You know I forgive you. I love you. Well, good, but... I still hope. You can recall the shuttle and remote pilot from here. Bring back the marker and we can return it to Aegis 7. You can make us whole again. I just want to make things right. And let's do it hmm. Do I trust Nicole at this point? I don't know who to trust. This is nuts. So we've got to recall the shuttle. Um, it'll bring Daniels back with a marker. <laughs> She's not going to be happy about that, though, is she? Damn it, Isaac. You don't know what you're doing. I know. I'm finally doing the smart thing. Fucking kidding me. Shit! Warning. Escape pod launch detected from shuttle USG-09. Escape pod. Damn. We lost her. It doesn't matter. She can't escape her fate. But who can? You're creepy. I don't know why we were ever boyfriend and girlfriend, quite honestly. <laughs> Because you just feel a bit... There's something off about you. Anyway. Um, looks like the shuttle's coming back. 
But I think Daniel's already got off in the escape pod, right? This is the end game. No regrets. Go. I'll reprogram the shuttle with our flight path to Aegis 7 and join you on board. Okay. So basically, guys, this is the end game. This is like the last level, I think. And uh, once we get on that ship, we're like locked into the end game. Bye bye, USG Ishimura. I'm not going to miss you. I'm not going to miss you one bit. We made it. Point of no return. You are about to leave the Ishimura and will not be able to return. Any active side missions will be abandoned. I don't care. Let's go. I want to finish this up. It's the last episode. We're going to do this, guys. We're going to see what the game has in store. Hopefully save the world from the Marcus curse. I never doubted you, Isaac. I knew you'd come back for me. Are you ready? There's something up with Nicole. Yeah. They've got the weirdest romance ever. <laughs> this is not a nice date. <laughs> this is their idea of a romantic drive. This isn't how I imagined saying goodbye to the Ishimura. Steady. I'm good. Are you afraid, Isaac? No. With you, I can handle anything. One more ride together, then. This all began in the core of the planet. Daniel said EarthGov built the marker. Some experiment they abandoned hundreds of years ago. This is cool, the way we're actually traveling to the planet in one shot. If you're not ready, a miracle must be as terrifying as a nightmare. Animals restless, hungry. It'll try to eat us alive. But we have the marker. We'll put things back the way they were. We will be whole again. I don't know what she means when she keeps saying we will be whole again. But I really think we don't want to find out what that means, maybe. <laughs> Succumb to the madness fully, maybe? The marker's madness? Let's just try and, uh, I guess, give the marker back to the planet so that that entity doesn't want to come after us anymore. So that's chapter 11 complete, and look, we're on the planet. Ooh, this is cool. Wow, look. We've got to unload the marker. All right, let's do this. Chapter 12, Dead Space. Ooh, the title of the game is the final chapter. It's kind of nice. I like it when games do that. So there we are, guys. That's the marker. We're delivering it back to the planet. Hopefully the, uh, the madness will stop. The gravity tethers on the issue are failing. The tectonic load. We don't have long before all that rock falls. How do we do this? We return the marker to its pedestal. The loading track leads directly to the excavation site. It'll work. The hive mind will obey. We'll be whole again. And you and I can Stop saying that. Stop it. Okay. Restore power to the shuttle. I can see Come where on. we need to restore we the power. Over here. So we're gonna need a battery, I think. For that, a power cell, I should say. Oh, more dead people. Safety protects people. It didn't protect them, did it? Oh my god, what is that? Oh no, it's one of the bats. It's one of the flying things. Do not dare try and resurrect people. I'm not having it. No! The bird did its thing! I 
hate those bird things because they just like resurrect people into enemies or like reanimate people I should say into enemies they're very sneaky the marker signal changes us we combine us but there's a dead space in that signal around the marker itself the eye of the store they can't stay in it for long I've seen it but this pedestal why there it amplifies Marker's pulse will be felt across the planet. The dead will sleep, and the living will see what can't be forgotten. Okay, I feel like that's too deep for me right now. <laughs> so I'm just gonna let you guys take that in. I'm gonna concentrate on fixing things up with this power cell. We have got a store like just through here. So I might actually try and buy some stuff in a second. Also, let's see if we can upgrade. I might be able to upgrade a little bit as well. Yeah, we've got five upgrades. So we can upgrade We could upgrade to suit a little bit if we wanted to. But you know what? I think I'm actually okay for suit upgrades. What I'm going to do instead is I'm going to upgrade our contact beam. Because I'm going to start using this a bit more. So we'll just upgrade this. There we go. And then we'll also upgrade the pulse rifle a little bit. We'll do the capacity and this one. There we go. Nice. Nodes well spent, I think. Plug this into here. I can kind of hear enemies somewhere, I think. Yep, over there. Okay, now we're going to power this up, guys. We're going to move the marker through this building. I think we need to get it to the other side of this complex, to the excavation site, right? That's what she was saying. But I have a feeling it's not going to be that easy. We're probably going to get stopped along the way. There's a big door. A giant-sized door for a giant-sized marker. Yeah, we have to wait until it clears one room before the door will unlock for us. So we can't race on too far ahead. Oh, look at this place. Oh, it's all overgrown. That's never a good sign, is it? Warning. Unknown biohazard detected. Quarantine in progress. We're going to have to destroy these enemies before we can progress. Oh, I hate these. I hate the baby ones. They're so annoying. Right, burn them a little bit. Then switch to the plasma rifle. The storm behind us. Oh god, run! Isaac, run! What are you doing? Okay, we're gonna cut through these legs. Grab this. Grab this! Okay, that's just in time. Sometimes it really doesn't grab how it should in this game. Notice how when something's close to the marker, it glows red like this. And it slows down. It's interesting. Get out of my way, man. It's like the marker actually has an effect on the enemies. Okay, this isn't good. I need to get one of the arms. Thank you. I'll have that, please. Grab the arm! I think this is the last one now, guys. It should be done now. Or maybe not. There's still another one. Great. Okay, that was a long fight, guys. I honestly don't know if I'm going to show you like all of these fights because they just go on so long. Do you miss them, Isaac? Yeah. And your parents? Your mother was a unitologist. She believed. She believed so much it killed her. Is this what she would have wanted? If she did, would that make this easier? Maybe it's a good thing I'll never know. Nicole's saying that Isaac's mother maybe would have appreciated what he's doing here. I'm not so sure myself. 
Now I need to lift the second one here. There we go. Keep that moving through here. What's in here? Oh, we've got something blocking the doorway. Might as well destroy that. Right, to the next room then. Isaac, there's no power in this section. The marker won't move. We're losing time. It's okay. Hit test connection. What's it say? Power failure detected. Oh Heavy no, data. these things. Ah. All right, that was close. We had to take out two of those big things. I hate them. They're like really deadly. I'm already running out of ammo after buying all that ammo as well because there's just so many enemies. We really have to go down there. Oh, okay. I guess if that's where we have to go, that's where we have to go. Doesn't look very inviting though, does it? But Isaac's brave. So it's all good. Make sure we're fully reloaded with all our weapons. So this is all offline currently. How do we get it online? got some cables and we've got some power cell routers. Okay, so are we just looking for more power cells? I'm guessing so. Oh yeah, here's one. Grab one of these things, plug it in. Power restored to east generator. Anything behind here? Nothing there. Hmm. Oh, might be one behind here though. Yeah, look, I can see it. It's hiding away. You can't hide from us. There you go. That's a second. We've got one more that we need to do. Oh no, I know what we're going to have to do. We're going to have to disable the elevator so that we can power this thing up and then all the enemies are going to spawn. You just watch. You just watch, guys. See, now the power's off. The enemies are going to spawn because I can't get out. Let's activate. Okay, it seems to be working. Oh, that's cool. We're gonna fly. Oh, we're gonna fly out with the spans. Come back to the marker quickly. The excavation safe just up ahead. Make us whole. So, guys, I think what we're gonna have to do here is blast the fan and try and like slink past like that. Okay. I'm just gonna scooch on by, don't mind me. There we go. How do we get out of here? Oh, over here. I'm not even gonna bother fighting all the enemies that just spawned. I'm just gonna escape because I don't wanna have to waste all my ammo. Yeah, now we just go back through to transport the marker again. That wasn't actually as bad as I was thinking it was gonna be. Hey, and here comes the marker. Nice. Good job. Oh, okay. Screw this. He's down. Oh, okay, get off me. Freak. Unhand me. I didn't say you could touch us. Oh, we've got a brute. Are you kidding me? God damn. Okay, run, 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 run. 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 Oh my god, we're gonna die, guys. We're gonna die. We're gonna die. We're gonna die. Blow it up. Keep running, keep running, keep running, keep running, keep running, keep running. Ooh. Okay, stop the brute. 
run around the back of him. We're going to have to take out these smaller enemies first. I say smaller enemies, they're still huge, but... And now, what we're going to do is we're going to try and lure the big boy over here. I need to stasis recharge first. Okay, come here. That's right. Now I'm getting around you, and I'm going to shoot you like this. That's it. Look at that. Boom. He's still alive. Of course he is. Of course he is. Oh, man, we've got one of these babies as well. I think I stopped him in the worst place possible. Die. Die, you freaking huge thing. Right, guys, we took care of him. Final one is the baby. Oh, my God, we survived that, guys. I don't know how we survived that. That was actually insane. That was actually mad. Let's lift this up. Get the marker going again. I think that was one of the most difficult fights we've had so far. I honestly thought we were going to die then. <laughs> that was nuts. Let's keep this marker going, though. Moving it through the room. The next door's opening up. Into another room. Oh, my God. Look at this room. Look at the state of it. Get the house cleaning in now. Oh, man. It looks like something out of Scorn. Do you remember that game we played, guys? Scorn. Reminds me of that a little bit. Oh, I think we shoot this. Yeah, there we go. So that's made us a little path. It's also roused some enemies. <laughs> Screw you, man. The objective here is to get to the top floor, I think. Look at him going back in slow-mo. That's kind of cool. Screw you. Ugh. Okay, that didn't work. Usually when you slap them around with this, with this gun, they go down in one hit, but they didn't that time. That was my bad. There's the one we want. Destroy that. And hopefully that's cleared a path for the marker now. Look, we have cleared a way, actually. It's completely clear now. So we can keep the marker going. And I reckon this might be the end now. It has to be, surely. There can't be more rooms after all of this. There we are. What a long journey we've been on to get us to this point. I mean, you think back, guys, we've played this game for, like, I think about 10 hours now. <laughs> it's a long game. But I have been enjoying it, I must say. I've really enjoyed, like, the playthrough. It's been fun, like, having you guys watch along and going on this journey in space. Look at that, we're back outside. So, yeah, we're out of the building now. This is, like, really good. Because I was kind of getting tired of those rooms. Get the marker to the pedestal. Hurry. Yes, ma'am. We're on it. Okay. How do you even avoid these? Like, seriously. Alright, we destroyed it. So I'm guessing we need to get into this control panel here. Into this, like, control room. We need to clear all the goop out of the way first. Oh, great. Explodey guys. At least they come in useful for one purpose. So we destroy that. We'll destroy the other tentacle. And unleash hell upon us as well. I like how the marker slows them down. I keep saying that, but it is really useful for us. I don't want to explode that like thing's belly, so I'm trying to like be very careful where I hit it. 
just hit the top part. There we go. Nice. You like that, did you? Probably not, actually, but I don't care. Okay. Where to next? Please, Isaac. The hive mind is coming. You have to make us whole. Stop talking about making us whole, man. It's freaking weird. Oh, okay. That was very close. No, get off me. I don't want to read that right now. What are you doing? Okay, I think we got it, guys. Yeah, we got it. Cool. Wait, what the heck is that? Wait, is that another tentacle? Yeah, that is another tentacle, right? We don't want to get squ squashed by that. We don't want to get crushed. Oh, it can move around. I didn't know that they could move around like this. Quick, go. All right, we got it, we got it, we got it. Am I even meant to be fighting all these guys? Guys, this is nuts. I think I'm maybe not meant to fight all these guys because there's so many of them. We've got to get over to the marker. Right, here we go. I think we've done it. The end of the mission is here. Let's activate this thing. Ooh, is that the end? Have we done it? Have we beat the game? Because that was uh, quite the climax of all these enemies like coming for us. Something's happening. We're kind of returning the market to the planet, right? Believed in you. Nicole. No problem. We're whole again. There she goes yeah. with that phrase again. Whoa. Emergency. Geo orbital gravity tethers offline. Tectonic load released. Impact imminent. The whole place is going to come down on us. Look at that. It's going to drop. The payload. I'll restart the tether. Buy us time. All right, let's go. Okay. Time to restore the uh, tether. Let's do it. Forget it, Isaac. What? There's no fixing this. You're on the Let planet go, too? Daniels. Let who go? Can't you see how delusional you are? We've got to go. Payload from the planet crack is about to fall. I gave you a chance to come around, Isaac. But if you still won't see it, I'll help you. One last time. Wrigley override. This time, watch to the end. Isaac, it's me. Oh, I wish I could talk to you. I'm sorry. So this is a message from the beginning of the game, right? From Nicole. I just wish I could talk to someone. It's all falling apart here. I can't believe what's happening. It's strange. Such a little thing. Just had a talk. That's all this research was in the end. Not much, is it? Just trying to make it listen when he begged for convergence. But I had a different prayer. It spoke. And then it listened. Make this stop, I said. Maybe it understood, but... She's not alive. Why can't I see you again, Isaac? I loved you. I always loved you. That's why she's different, isn't it? She's not Nicole, after all. 
She's just a vision from a marker. Yeah, because our Nicole is not alive anymore, as you can see. She took her life. Man, that is, um, yeah, that is kind of a sad twist for old Isaac. So who is Nicole been the whole time? She's Elizabeth Cross. Oh, the scientist. I'd forgotten about her, I'll be completely honest. Jacob Temple for her, and Nicole for you. Jacob. Yes, yeah, so the marker tricked both of them into thinking that they were their significant Jacob. other. What the hell did you do? You did this to yourself. Nicole's been dead this whole time. You just couldn't handle it, could you? Because if she's gone... At least now it'll be in safe hands. The marker won't turn anyone else into its puppet. Give me the loader remote. No. Daniels is Nicole. evil, man. <laughs> We're whole again. For Jacob. Jacob. Think I'm not going to ask again, Cross. No, enough people will die. Then just do it. I've got nothing left to lose. Oh. Cross. Ice cold. It's better this way, Isaac. You'll never recover from what the marker's done to you. And when the tectonic will drops, all this will be buried. Just like Earth God wanted. Oh no! Daniels, I trusted you. You betrayed us multiple times at this point. Warning. Seismic activity increasing. Evacuate to safe location. Reach the landing pad. Alright, this is our last ditch effort to get off this place, guys. We've got to go for it need to find a save point as well. I don't want to die at this point. Look at the planet out there. It's like a desert. Kind of looks Shut a bit like Mars, doesn't it? I can still make it before she leaves. All right, let's go, guys. We're going to get off this place now. So we found out the truth about Nicole. She wasn't alive the whole time. It was just a vision from the marker, like, kind of getting into our brain, making us do what it wanted. But now we got to stop Daniels, because she's going to make a big mistake at this point. Okay, let's bust through this. Where's this going to bring us out? The living quarters. Oh, we're back in here. The room we're in earlier. That stupid religion has caused all of this for unitology. All right, let's go, guys. Get back to our ship. Get off this rock. Ooh. Last warning, Isaac. I mean it. She doesn't want to kill us. She still likes Isaac. She doesn't want his death on her conscience, does she? I still don't like her after all the stuff she's done. Oh, that's karma for you. Look, Isaac's still trying to save her. He's got a soft spot for her, obviously. Wow, okay. She's she's gone. No saving that. What is this thing though? Is this like this is a hive one they're talking about, right? Like the thing that's connected to the marker, I guess. Oh, you can see all its veins. Oh yeah, we saw it on the monitor, didn't we? We saw it on the uh, monitor when the doctor was talking to us. Okay, let's do this. Come on. <laughs> let's do it. I guess just blast it. Oh, okay. So this is tricky. We're going to have to destroy this thing, guys. We've got loads of um, supplies, though, which is good. Okay, what's happening now? Oh, it's barfing these up. Ugh. Gross. In fact, you know what? I might as well use this. Just saw them up, right? We need to use this again, the contact beam. Yeah, the contact beam is really good for taking these like little spores out like super fast. There you go. Let's see if we can hit another one. Oh, maybe not. Ah! Okay, let's destroy these. 
All right, they're all, they actually self-explode, so we don't actually need to, um, to destroy them all ourselves. Okay, we got another one of those. This thing is giant, man. I don't even know what we're meant to do here. Just, just avoid its, its spew, its toxic spew. Just run, 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 run. I'm not even going to shoot them. I don't think we have to. I think they eventually explode. So as long as we, like, avoid it, we should be okay. There we go. We got it. Is that it down? Is that it dead? I don't know. I'm going to get this health while I can. Oh, no. What's it doing now? What's it doing now, guys? Oh, it's, it's, it's spawning enemies, of course. Great. You want some as well? I can go all day. There's so many enemies right now. If I'm being quiet, guys, I'm just concentrating because this is insane. All right, here we go. Slow them down for a bit. Give ourselves a brief reprieve. I'm glad we've got the buzzsaw because it's really useful for just cutting through, like, masses of enemies at once. Okay, it's uh, doing something. You all right there, mate? Okay, what do you want me to do? I'm having that health, by the way. Oh, it's trying to squish us now. And it's doing quite well at that as well. Oh, we've got to blow up the bits in the middle. There. So, yeah, there's a round two going on right now. Ah, acid! Acid, 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 acid. I guess we're just kind of trapped now against the acid. Man, how are we meant to avoid this? Oh, great, I got burned. All right, shoot the next one. This thing is insane. It's gonna try and six like acid on us again. Okay. I was trying to judge that, and I misjudged it. Go! Okay, we're doing okay. We've got a lot of space to play with this time. Now shoot it again. Shoot these little ball sacks that it has. We good? Oh no, oh no, oh no, oh no, 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 no. Oh, it's doing multiple ones now. Great. Okay, I think we're okay. We're okay, we're okay. Dodge it. Man, this is insane. You just have to judge exactly when it's going to come crashing down with those arms. Move that way now. And shoot the next one. Great, we almost did it then, guys. We've still got one more to do. Okay, I'm going to wait till it starts sticking up. Oh, come on. I thought I cleared that. Go, 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 go. I haven't got any health, guys. Okay, we're probably dead now. Yeah, I'm gonna die. 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 I'm gonna die, guys. Please let me live. Okay, we're we're alive. We're alive, guys. We're alive. Okay. Any more? Oh no, it's grabbed us. Holy crap. Um, okay, what are we meant to do now? Oh, we're actually meant to shoot the bit in the middle, somehow. Man, how am I meant to shoot this thing? Oh, there you go, I'm shooting it. Hit it, hit it, hit it. Are you kidding me? 
Reload! Reload, Isaac! Your life depends on it! I think we got it. Holy moly! Is that it dead? Oh my god, my heart's beating, guys. That was insane! I think that's it dead. I think we took it down. Rest in peace, hive mind. Oh, he's gonna wanna shower after that. He is gonna wanna shower. All right, I'm taking the med pack. Let's get off this place, guys. Let's get out. <laughs> that was quite the showdown. I think we might have beaten the game. I think that might be it. Go, Isaac, go! You've literally got nothing to lose now. <laughs> you might as well get out of here. All the crew is dead. Your girlfriend's dead. Just get out. Nice. I think we've made it. Maybe? Look at that. Oh, it's going to crash into the planet. Wow, that's kind of epic. Completed. That's the game done, guys. That's the last chapter. The Silver Steam achievement. Nice. Round of applause, everyone. We did it. We did it. We can finally take his helmet off. That's going to be sweaty in there. Forgot what his face looked like. It's been so long. I think it's me. Oh, I wish I could talk to you. I'm sorry. Delete. Painful memory. What the heck? Oh my god. Is that like uh, her ghost or something? Nicole's ghost? I guess the memory of Nicole is always going to haunt Isaac's mind. I think that actually ties into like the second game, if I remember. Again, it's been a long time since I played it, but I believe like she haunts Isaac in the second game a little bit. But yeah, guys, that was Dead Space. So hopefully you enjoyed my playthrough of that game. Obviously, a longer playthrough because this game's around 10 hours or so. And the series didn't perform as well as I'd hoped. I almost stopped midway through because I saw the views weren't there to really support it. But there was so many people like really asking for me to finish the series. I thought, you know what, I'm going to stick with it to the end. Because I did really enjoy this game. I do think in the future I probably won't do too many series like this because it is quite repetitive seeing me just shoot loads of enemies and stuff. The story stuff's interesting, but maybe I'll just do like story explain videos for these kind of games. I'm not going to be doing a story explain video for Dead Space just to uh, pre-warn you because it's a game that's been out for so long that I really don't think it warrants one. It was really fun though playing through this guys. I had a really great time. Dead Space was a game that I really really loved back in the Xbox 360 days and it's been just a really long time since I played it to the point where I'd forgotten most of the uh, story details there. But it was really cool seeing it brought to life in this way with modern technology and the quality of life improvements to gameplay and story which kind of elevated it above the original game for me. So thanks for joining me on this journey. I appreciate those who stuck with it. And if you did enjoy this series, leave a like below, comment, let me know what your favorite part of Dead Space was. And of course, subscribe for more videos just like this one. And I will see you all on the next one.